Okay, we are making the holidays easy for you, especially in the kitchen. We have world-renowned chef Curtis Stone joining us for the next two hours. And he's not only an amazing chef, it's also his birthday. We'll be singing happy birthday a little later on to the one and only chef Curtis Stone who's been with us since 2012. He's getting ready for a big two hours with everybody because this is his final show before Thanksgiving. We've got some brand new items coming up for everyone. Don't forget about our today's special. You've asked for it. We love the Dura pans. Now we've got Dura Bake Wear for everyone. It's a set of three, the 10 by 15, the 9 by 13, which yes, fits in your standard toaster ovens, and the Mac Daddy 12 by 17. So amazing cookie sheet that we've got for you. It's $5.99 for you to go ahead and get this home. So again, everything that you're seeing today from Chef Curtis Stone is on five interest-free credit card payments. Let me say that again. Five interest-free credit card payments. Now normally, we would start off our hour with our today's special, but it's gonna be coming up in just about six or seven minutes. But we wanna let you know about a little secret sale that we've got coming up for everyone, because there's over 31,000 of our today's special sold. 31,000. So it's been on fire since we launched it yesterday at 10 p.m. So we've got an amazing, amazing show in store for everyone. So we love having Chef Curtis Stone joining us. If you see behind me, his right-hand girl, Rochelle, she's gonna be sharing with us her amazing cookbook coming up. And she also is getting ready because we've got an incredible cookware set we're gonna be talking about. So sit back, relax. Think about what you're cooking this Thanksgiving. Who's doing all of the cooking? What do you have to make? What do you have to bring to the table? because here is your new kitchen makeover. Look at this eight piece set. Starting off right there, you've got the five quart. You're also going to receiving that beautiful 10 inch. You've got the 2.8 quart included in there. Just close your color, whether you want the turquoise blue or the rice car red, you also get that 10 inch fry pan and the steamer insert. You get it all today for under $26. So let's have some fun with the one and only Chef Curtis Stone. We're thrilled that he's here with us. You know. I have to, I have to brag for a little bit about you. There are two pages that we can say about Chef Curtis Stone. <laughs> Which one do you want me to say first? Go huh? on. Just, you don't have to say anything. Just say happy I'm birthday. Just Hi. How are you, my I'm friend? doing great. How are you? Mm -hmm. nice, nice to, to have see you, you here. Thank Especially you. Especially before Thanksgiving. Right. Well, Thanksgiving is when we do all the prep, we do all the oh. cooking, we do all the cleaning up, all the stuff that we love and all the stuff that we don't really love. Exactly. And I've got a few things to make it all a bit easier for you. Okay. So let's kick everything off with, because the prep work, right? Yep. Who hates doing the mashed potato peeling? Me. Me. Um, look, there's an easy way to do this and there's a hard way to do this. I prefer the easy way. What we've got for you is a set of four peelers. There's a straight edge peeler, a julienne peeler, a corn husker, and then a serrated peeler, which is great for those soft fruits. Let me just dive in and get started, because when you see it, you'll understand it. First of all, let's grab a potato, right? This is what you're going to use for your straight edge peeler on. Now, we do this, we call this the Y peeler. See how it looks a bit like a Y? Otherwise known as the speed peeler, because you can go through vegetables really, Really, really fast. See, sometimes when you see potato, see, I'm purposely leaving those eyes in there because sometimes they turn into a. I've, I've put in a little eye remover, right? So if you get a little piece of that potato that you don't want, you can just go through and, and just remove it like that. It's super, super fast. You can see how quickly you can work through a potato like that, flip it around both on the same way. So that's the straight edge. We all know how easy it is to use a straight edge peeler, but stick with me, because watch this. Next, I've got the julienne peeler. Now, whether you're doing a soft vegetable okay. or a hard vegetable, this will allow you to Ooh. go through See how you're able to go through and create a julienne or fine strips, whether it be the zucchini, that. squash, potatoes, carrots, hard, soft, you name it, and it will just go through it this. so, so easy. And so, so cool. So, you know, if you're, if you're trying to eat healthy, mm -hmm. you can have a raw diet, right? Because you'll be able to turn beautiful vegetables into a salad. And I'm going super Easy. slow so you can see it. But you can see just how quick you can move through this oh stuff, gosh. right? So there are a couple of soft ones. Let me show you a hard one, like a carrot. And by the oh way, yeah. this is the smallest carrot in the world. We if, <laughs> if you got big carrots, it would be a little um, even easier than that. But have a look how quickly Why you can go through so it. Well, because they're beautiful stainless 
stainless steel sharp blades, you know, so you're able to do all oh. these vegetables in a matter of seconds. You don't have to buy them already pre-cut, ladies. It takes seconds. You're seeing it first. They right. stack beautifully. I want to show you they all connect together, so easy storage for you. Moving on, so Moving I'm gonna on. I'm gonna come back and do more okay. of that because I find it fun after a little while. Look at this straight edge peeler and what you can do with Parmesan cheese. So again, oh, wow. because of the sharpness of that blade, you're able to do cheese, chocolate, vegetables, you name it. Come on down here. Absolutely. I'm gonna show oh, this you the, is the best one. Watch this. This is, the, this is so fun. It's called the corn husker, right? You hold your ear of corn just like that, and then you get your corn husker, you drag it straight along, and look. There it is. Oh. So you remove all of the corn, none of the husk, right? So you're not getting you, any of the um, any of the stuff trick. you don't want. You're absolutely right. So forget about frozen corn. You're able to use fresh corn every single time, super, super fast. I mean, there is not one cob in there. It's just the corn. Right. You're getting all of the stuff you want and none of the stuff that you don't. And you, you get don't. all four of these today for only $15.95. Don't forget, everything Chef Curtis Stone is bringing to us is on five interest-free credit card payments. Absolutely everything. <laughs> so what does that mean people are paying for one? Three dollars and 19 cents. <laughs> oh my goodness. Three dollars, whoa! It's so it. fast, Corn's right? It's going crazy over okay. there. So let's, okay. do a, let's do a soft fruit, like maybe um, a, a mango. So oh. this is now the serrated edge, right? So imagine being able to, to peel a mango. I'll do it oh, this way so could. you can see it. You know, so something as soft as a mango. What about a tomato? Look, again, the serrated edge allows you to oh, peel the this. skin off a tomato. Now, something. I notice you're pulling this way. Is that the correct way? Have I been doing it you, wrong? You can do it either way. You can do it that way. It'll work both directions towards you, away from you. Ah. I find I've got a bit more control okay. when I'm doing it towards I me. I think you're right. Yeah, I need to do that. Of okay. course, you know, if you want to do... Um, Orange zest, again, that serrated peeler will just allow you Look to just pull through that so fast and so effortless. So, you know, the, the serrated peeler is good for both soft and really hard things too. And now, how things do I clean this, Chef? What's the best Oh, thing? you throw it in the dishwasher. See? Yeah, the whole is, thing goes in. Oh, everything goes in the dishwasher. This is the set that everybody needs to have right now for the holiday season because this is when we're prepping the corn, right? This is when we're doing all the stuffing. This is when we're doing, you know, we need the zest of that orange. So again, you're receiving all of them today. I don't want you to think you've got to choose. You receive you absolutely all, all of them. Look so, at those little chocolate curls that you get in there. Oh, so that's for lovely. all of you cake decorating, so I've done that in about 10 seconds, and you put these beautiful little chocolate curls Ooh. straight over your cupcakes like that. Or put it on top of your coffee. Oh yeah, nice idea. Oh, nice idea. mixed with a little Bailey. You know, my favorite, cream. my favorite okay. of all of these, I've got to be honest, it's the julienne. Because even on a potato, you know, think about potato luck, luck, luckers, luck, luckers. What is that? <laughs> I don't know, yeah. Those what? like crispy potato cakes. Potato cakes. Luck, luckers. Luck, luckers. How do you say? <laughs> we don't have Lotkas. them in Australia, so. Lotkas, right? Lotkas. Lotkas. <laughs> Potato uh, I'm cakes. I'm from Michigan. Wait, I'm not any help right there. <laughs> Look how easy this is. Hey, you get all four of them today. It. Don't wait until, oh my gosh, I got to get the mashed potatoes ready. And you get out that old rusty peeler and you start, right? And you're thinking, oh my gosh, this is going to take me all day. It's a great hostess gift too. Oh, absolutely. And they all stack together. Look so if that. you're making the mashed potatoes, you know you need to get a new peeler. And you think about those brands out there. They charge about $10 for one peeler. You receive all four of them. They stack together today and it's $3.19. Right, look at that eggplant. So fast, Ooh. so easy. This is like the dream peeler, you guys. How do I know which one does what? Or do I just, does, are they? Well, just... they nest, so they're oh, they always do, they together. Do. You'll see the straight edge yeah. one oh, is yeah, for yeah, peeling yeah. veggies. Right, you see that? They're all So nest. simple. And I love the little eye that you put on there so I don't have to use the knife to get it out. Right, so you do that entire eggplant literally in seconds. Same. Even squash. Okay, they're moving us along. We have a lot of okay. you ordering these. Don't forget about mm -hmm. our best buy of the day coming up next, but we do want to let you know. Oh, I ordered these last time you oh were on. Oh my goodness, these are the ultimate. Brilliant. I call Brilliant. Them, I call them my essential set. The perfect turner, the most amazing wooden spoon, even though it's made out of nylon, and then a spurtle. So three pieces that really just blow your mind and can do everything in the kitchen. You I'm so excited. I love my, yeah, when you're stirring in there, it's absolutely amazing. Right. Okay, and then the mitts, hold on. Oh Wait yes. 
Birthday boy, look what he's with, brought to us. With a little hook, so that can hang in your kitchen. Is that nice and soft? Set it oh, to yeah, feel yeah, that, yeah. isn't that nice? Oh, they're so, not like the hard silicone ones. Oh, no, it's, ones. it's beautiful on the inside, because it's material. You can see back there, we've got that beautiful soft material on the inside. But then the top here, this is silicon. So material on the inside and down here, but then silicon where you need it, because that goes up to 500 degrees. They're genius. We do have those available for you, but are you ready for our only bakeware, our Dura <laughs> Bake Today's special of the year. Let's get set, let's get ready. It's holiday cooking time. you're ready for the holiday season, we're gonna make sure you are the best chef this season. In fact, Chef Curtis Stone is bringing to us, exclusively sold here at HSN, what's called as Bake. You're receiving all three pieces, the 10 by 15, the nine by 13, and the 12 by 17. We're gonna go through all the details. Normally we sell a two piece for about $40. You get all three. That toaster oven size is amazing. You just choose whether you want this in the red, the green, the gold, the dark gray, or is turquoise blue, it's $5.99. If you go into any Chef Gourmet store, first of all, you won't find Chef Curtis Stone Durapans there, and you're never going to see this type of a value, because nobody has well, look at what this. Durapan has. It's the coating that makes it so magic. Look, I just put some cheese into this pan. Look at it. Stop it. Not only is it melting it, it's literally just falling off the pan. You see how that's just sliding away? Look at that. If cheese won't stick to the pan, nothing will. And I'm gonna keep just pushing this product the whole way through this demonstration just to prove to you how strong and durable it really is. So look at that. Now, the cleanup on this pan, this is what I like the absolute most because here you go. You get yourself a cloth, you give it a quick wipe. Now you're saying, well, that was just a bit of melted cheese. But wait until you see what I, I am gonna do. I'm and just gonna keep pushing it. if you have any of Chef Curtis Stone's, whether it's dirt Pan, which created the whole nonstick craze into the Durapan bakeware. So if you have it, give us a call. The testimonial right. lines on the give bottom us of the a screen. ring. We want to hear from you. And it's his birthday. Yeah. So this is a frittata. It's just eggs, vegetables, some mushrooms. Mm. You could put bacon. You could put some turkey sausage. Whatever you like. But oh, Ooh, that's sorry, okay. I'm throwing things that's at okay. you. That's okay. I'm using. <laughs> <laughs> so you know you can see that right there. Super easy. Again, the wow. cleanup on the pan is literally Why? a wipe. Why is it nothing? There's well, nothing. Well, it's because of the, co the coating, and I'm going to show you that in a moment. But have a look here. Now, you'll notice that I'm going to cut my frittata here with my... This is called the turner. It's one of a set of three. It's the spoon, the turner, and the spurtle that you just saw before. You are my love. Thank Little. you. I know it's not breakfast time, but there's... That's okay. I even do this for my boys. I'll literally cut these into little squares. They call them the zucchini slice, because I do it with zucchini and cheese. Um, and the, the, they take those in their lunchbox, these beautiful little squares. So, little Every frittata. Everything is nice and brown, right. evenly Even brown. Cooked. Look at that. Can you say this about your bakeware? Does your bakeware have what I call cookies of Christmas past on them? <laughs> well, this, right? is, this is your choice. You can have cookies in the Dura pan, and this is what happens when you move them around. They just mm. slide. Or you can do it in the one that you've probably got at home. You can see that ain't sliding. And oh. you've got a... You've got to go no, under. Don't say you broke one. That's yeah, it. Well, you know, you're going to break lots them. when they stick, you know. So, look, that that or this. I know which one I'd rather. I'd rather the Durapan, which has such great nonstick qualities. But let me show you the technology in how we make this, because okay. once you see that, then I guarantee you're going to say, oh, now I understand it. We make it out of carbon steel. It's mm. super strong. In fact, eight times stronger than other nonstick on the market. We put those four layers of the nonstick. Durapan, it's exclusive to us. This is the only place you will find it. It's so strong that you can use stainless steel utensils on it. I'll say it again. Metal utensils, whisks, spoons, it doesn't matter. You will not scratch it. Nothing will stick. Everything's just going to release, whether it's cookies or a roast turkey. It's just such beautiful cookware. <laughs> Amy, she knows she's going to have to speak, but she's got a big mouthful of frittata still. Ooh, and it's, I'm, it's hot, warm. I know. Steamy. I burned my mouth yesterday with you. <laughs> Patience, Amy, and I will pace myself, but I'll tell you, the food tastes so good because you're not adding any extra oils, butter, right. spray stuff. No. And look, it's all oh, peppermint. I mean, this is, this is literally oh, white chocolate poured stop. onto the pan. Then we put the chocolate ganache, then more white chocolate, right? Oh. So there's no oil or anything, and you think, well, that might stick. Well, watch this. I, I bet you I can just go like that. Oh. And look, without even getting underneath it, you can release look it. Look at that. And then... 
Look, perfect white chocolate that's clearly just been melted on. And then I'm going to go ahead and break that into Rochelle, what, big or what do they call that glass candy? What is that? You know, you do the hard candy. Oh, yeah. Is it called glass candy? Yeah, I think so. Have you ever made that? Have you ever made that? It is so, so hard good. to make. Spun sugar? Yeah. Is that what you're talking about? Is that what it is? I'm not yeah. sure. Mm -hmm. It's only in your head, my darling. <laughs> I spend lots of things, and food is mostly one of them. Rochelle, come say hello. Hi. We've got the darling Rochelle oh, with hi. us. We love you, Rochelle, thank and you. you bring your talents to oh, us thank you. in more ways than one. Oh, thanks. So, that looks Rochelle wrote a book. Yeah. And it's called The Bakeware Cookbook. Mm -hmm. It's right here. That's right. I'm so yeah. proud of it, Rochelle. You tell Thank everyone you. about it, and I'll flick through the pages. Well, it was inspired by your bakeware. You know, I mean, you have this gorgeous nonstick bakeware, and you said, well, hey, would you write a cookbook? And I said, I would love to. So I put all my favorite recipes. These mm. are seriously recipes that I have been working on oh, for a so long beautiful. time, and I made them super simple for the home cook, okay? And I made sure that every single recipe had an image. So you'll see nice short ingredient lists, ingredients you can find everywhere, things that are family favorites, everything oh, from yes. a dessert to a breakfast That's to Dinner, sheet pan suppers, even a salad. I think this sheet pan is so gorgeous. And here, here's my favorite part of the whole book, Rochelle. Yeah. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that picture of you. I chose that picture of you, you to put you in there. Rochelle, yes, your I recipes it was so are good. so delicious Thank and you. so they wonderful. Are. Is this in there? Thank you for sharing them. Um, it's not actually, no. It's going to go in, a next, in any future book because it's moly. amazing. It's so look, good. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. How would you make peppermint bark? Well, Honestly, I mean, you couldn't make it in any other pan. You'd be using parchment paper, and then that yeah. would be sticking. And true, I've done it before. It's not easy. In a restaurant environment, you make it on a marble slab. We don't all have marble slabs, you know? No. Um, and, of course, here's the cool part, the cleanup. Now, that's sticky, sticky, sticky. Mm. And look how I'm just giving it a real quick wipe. And, yeah, this is about as stubborn as it gets. And look at that. In about five or six real quick wipes, it's spotless. If you have this bakeware at home, please give us a ring and tell us what you <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, I don't want you to take like just it. my word for it. Nothing, nothing like it. I have it. I have all of his Durb, hand, cook, Durb hands. I have everything that Chef Curtis Stone makes, except for right here. I don't have the toaster oven. I will tell you, once you use, whether it's his cookware or his Durb hands, there's no going back. You're not adding any extra fat. It makes cleanup such a breeze. You can even put these in the dishwasher. Normally, we sell two of them for $40. Right. Today, you're receiving three of them, including that toaster oven size, which is that 9 by 13. Which is the one I just pulled out of that little toaster oven. You get all of it today for under $6. Don't wait till a week before Thanksgiving and run out and try to find Dura pans or Dura bakeware. You won't. Chef Curtis Stone designed exclusively for us here at HSN. He's a world-renowned chef. You've seen him on Top Chef. You, you've seen him on the Food Network with Rachel Ray. You've seen him everywhere. And this well, is today, the cleanup, Amy. he's bringing all of his talents just to us at HSN. Look, Look at, that. at that. That's the cleanup. You literally just wipe it clean. That's that it. just did a sheet pan dinner. This is one of the recipes in Rochelle's book. It's salmon, it's broccoli, it's carrots and broccolini. You throw mm. it all in, and then it's we call it a sheet pan dinner because it's just that. Mm. I mean, the same with the ribs. Well, I'm not even gonna make make it out that we did them. Rochelle, you can oh buy great word. ribs these days, That's right? So, so we true. bought the ribs, we glazed oh. it, we baked it in the oven for an hour, and they're fantastic. Have a look at this. When they come out, they're super and super tender. Okay. I'm going to stick them up on my chef's cutting board, also available for you guys. Mm. And check these ribs out, right? And so you want to just... slow bake them. And usually that barbecue sauce would be a sticky old mess. You know that. Today, you're getting them all. The 10 by 15, the 12 by 17, and then I believe it's the 9 by 13. 9 by 12 or 9 by 13. Yeah, you're right. You get them all today for $5.99. Technology mm -hmm. and performance that nobody else has. So don't wait because this is it. This is it with your big visit before Thanksgiving. Here, here's the best part. So this just baked those ribs, right? So you know that that's probably a soaker. Unless, of course, you've got the Dura Bake and you can just go ahead and wipe that pan clean. If you have this, uh -huh. guys, give us a ring because you're going to have the exact same experience that I'm having right here. I am. I'm going to have that experience. Look at this. <laughs> have the ribs oh. gone. Let's see. <laughs> I love it when you're here with me, Amy. I know. Mm. You, you mm. dive in and it's mm. just beautiful mm. to watch. Mm. 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 I'm, well, how could I not eat? I mean, it's rude for me to talk with my mouth while I apologize. But mm. look at that. Check out these veggies. So I've roasted carrots oh, and squash and onions. And look, they literally just fall out of the pan. And again, the cleanup is going to be a wipe. That's the thing that just gets me every single time. It's the wipe, mm. you know. Mm. It sort of makes the cleaning the cleaning process fun. Mm. 
if that's possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Even mm. a stuffing. So, you know, this, this actually came from an email from someone like you. You wrote in to us and you said, listen, I need a little one that can fit in a toaster oven, right? Can you do a sheet pan that, that can fit in a toaster oven? That was me that wrote oven? to you, darling. <laughs> I said, please, please you should please, see please. my toaster oven tray. It's awful. Look, but look at this. Look right. at that pan. Look at the pan. Imagine doing all of your stuffing, because that's how we usually do our stuffing, right? Or you do it stove top, then you put it in the oven. Right. You know, but here, look Amy, at that. Here's the best part. Have a look at the stuffing. Look underneath the caramelization. Oh, that we're is get. that beautiful? Can you believe it? That beautiful, crispy caramelization that you're going to get underneath when you're using the right pans. And think about this now. Glass. I want to compare because when we do casseroles, yep. or here when I do, even my producer is just reminding me, we do stuffing. It's in those glass. Right. Those are, number one, so hard to clean. Yep. It's not as good a conductor of heat either, is it? Because no. this is carbon steel. Correct. This is carbon steel. It's so easy to clean. With glass, the truth okay. is, you're probably going to have to soak it. Oh, you know, I do. Every Thanksgiving. Here's a mac and cheese that I've popped in the oven. Oh, look at this. All right, so have a look at this. Okay. Now, normally, you just serve mm. this in the tray because it's so beautiful. Right. Right? But have a look what I'm going to okay. do. I'm literally just going to let it pour on out mm. just to show you the cleanup. <gasps> I mean, look at how that sauce, that's a cheese sauce, and it's just literally floating away. Now, if you're watching oh me do word. this with a stainless steel utensil and you're like, don't, mm. you'll scratch it. Don't worry, you're not gonna scratch it. We've made it stainless steel utensil safe, so you can go ahead, use your stainless steel utensils, look at and that. again, that's the cleanup. Have you ever seen anything like this? Honestly, Isn't that so cool? It makes cooking such a breeze, so much easier, whether it's cookies or, you know, maybe you're somebody right now doing the rolls for Thanksgiving and you always burn the rolls or they're not evenly cooked. Probably because what you're using isn't four times worth of the nonstick that's inside of all of the Dura pans. So think about doing the rolls. Are they always sticking? Are they always burnt? Yep. It's not your toaster oven or your oven. It's probably what you're using to cook them on. Or but you hear them in the toaster oven, it warps, you know, you hear that pop of your, your bakeware, that'll never happen. Right, now you're looking at a three piece set. Mm -hmm. I can't quite believe I'm saying this for $29.95. Three, you're getting all three pieces. If you love to bake and you need round pans, we're also selling those as a set of two. We're also selling our muffin tins, still with the same Dura Bake set of two. Um, so you'll get 24 muffins in total. We've got popovers. We've got a set of three baking pan here. This is actually the pizza pan. Um, so all oh. of that's all available at um, dot com. So go to hsn.com and take a look but i'm gonna turn over a cake here okay. and this is a um, pumpkin spice cake it's is literally it? a sheet pan cake so the whole cake is done in the pan like that you just bring it over here i'm gonna turn it out i just drop it like that Come on, out you come. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where are you? It's shy Sometimes today. you give it a little slap, you know, because it might just it might just stick in there, and then it will. Then you can do that. <laughs> <laughs> Did it come? Did it come? Come on, Cat. It it's thinking about it. It's thinking about it. <laughs> it's a little hot. Uh, it's still a little warm. Okay, so there you go. It's 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 all on its way out. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Sometimes it just takes a moment because um, the, it, it's such a sticky batter, right? So. Mm. We're, we're pushing this to its absolute limit. We're proving to you that you don't even need to use mm. any grease or, or butter. Then what you do is you take that, that sheet pan cake, you roll it up, you let it cool, mm -hmm. right? Once it cools, you're going to unroll it, and then you're going to fill it with the cream. So, th you know, we're doing these kind of things around the holidays, like... Um, like this beautiful cake here. Oh, so, you know, is that the jelly gingerbread rolls? or pumpkin? This is the gingerbread. Oh, stop it. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, this, I'll tell you, when you try Have this. A taste of that, my oh, love. please. <laughs> <laughs> I told Rochelle earlier, I dreamt about this cake last night. Is it's that so sick good. or what? Oh, my goodness. I, don't I couldn't blame help you. it. It's just so good. Is this in the cookbook? <laughs> That one is not. Oh, I think we're going to have to do a second one. <laughs> second she's edition. Out. She's going to be doing her second one. But did you see everything that's coming out of this? How brown it is. Nothing sticking. So whether right. it is something from doing your stuffing to doing beautiful, you know, cakes, whatever. Nothing. All oh, the pizza. Right. Nothing sticking. So, get all three. So check this out. It's okay. called a sheet pan lasagna. This one pizza is in Michelle's book. So all the stuff that's non-seasonal mm. is absolutely in mm. her book. But watch this. I'm going to literally just give it a shake. Check this out, Amy. Um, this is a, this is a <gasps> lasagna. Yeah. That. And have a look at the pan. 
it's spotless, you guys. So again, when it comes time to clean it, you're going to pick up um, a cloth. Mm. You're going to give it a real quick old wipe and you lift up any of that pan. You've got a perfectly clean pan. Now, let's have a look at the actual lasagna for a moment. Absolutely. Right? Gorgeous. So I'm just going to pull that back over here just this a little. Amazing. So... We have a couple of these left. This is my Santoku knife. It is a beauty. Oh, mm. I think we started the day with a couple of thousand. I don't know how many oh. exactly we have, but I know we're down to final quantities on it. But to go through and sort of cut yourself a piece of that gorgeous lasagna and then using that really flexible lifter, this is why I love this lifter so much. You can get down and get underneath things, you know, without, oh, um, without having to... Uh, bend or break so i've made this extra flexible the head of that so you can get down and get underneath it so delicious lasagna really really simple to make what else you got for me rochelle nachos. i told you i was going to go fast yeah, i was like i'm I know. fine i'm ready to go <laughs> oh, the nachos are out okay, okay. hallelujah Think about the big football game, right? right? This is what we're. This is what we all want: perfect nachos with nothing sticking. Oh boy! Okay, so what I'm going to do is just give this, oh, look at this again, just a little nudge, and you're going to watch this melted cheese just slide right on out of my pan. Do you remember the last time you made nachos? And do you remember the cleanup situation? All I'm going to do, I'm using a stainless steel utensil. Get those crispy pieces of cheese because I love the taste of those. Oh, and get the salsa and guacamole and the dips going. Oh yeah. But oh, here's, the, here's the clean up first. You can see the steam rising off it because it's so hot still. But you just give that a wipe and you've got a perfectly clean but pan. But if you want Again. to, you could throw this in the dishwasher. I'm telling you, this is the last bakeware you'll ever, ever have to buy. And when you go to any of the gourmet stores or, hey, you just buy regular baking cooking pans, how expensive are they? And you know you're going to be throwing that money away because next year it's going to be warped. It's got mm -hmm. the stains on it you can't get off. When we talk about Durapans, nobody else in the world has the Durapans. It's only here at HSN, or Durapans, right. Durabake. It started off with this Durapan cookware we've got coming up next hour. Now we've got the Durapan bakeware, mm -hmm. and there's still more to come because it's the technology that's put into this that nobody else in the world has. Right. Normally we sell a set of two of these for $40. Today it's all three, you just choose your color. So it's a 12 by 17, the 10 by 15, and the nine by 13, and we'll show you all the great colors. I'm sorry, Chef, the, the four layers that you have, nobody else has, no, right? No, it's exclusive to us. You won't find it anywhere else, and that's what gives you that crazy food release. I mean, you're watching cookies slide off that pan. That really happens, by the way, which is pretty... I mean, you're watching it with cheese. No matter what it is that you're baking, it's all going to just slide straight on out of the pan. Well, Chef, because mm. we're so happy you're here... Yes. I want... We all wanted to surprise you oh. with a happy... I, actually, Rochelle made this. I can't take any Rochelle, credit for it. Rochelle, you're so Look sweet. Look what she did. Look at that. Notice nothing you sticking. Angel. Look, it still doesn't stick. <laughs> Even my birthday doesn't <laughs> stick. Oh, okay, on so the center of his cake. Check this out. What is it, Rochelle? Chocolate disc? Chocolate disc. It's just melted white chocolate. With a little bit of uh, dark chocolate Aww. for the writing and some edible Look gold. At that. Isn't, gold. isn't that pretty? Happy thank birthday! You, thank you so much. Another 29. Yeah. Right? All right, exactly. well, we're going to head out to the phones. Vicky's been Here very patient. Vicky, you're live on the air. How are you doing today? Hi, Vicky. I'm doing fine. How are you? <laughs> oh, this is such a good day, isn't it? With Chef Curtis Stone it's here. Beautiful nice to meet you, day. Sweetie. Happy birthday, Chef. Thank you, Vicky. Thank you so much. I'm going to decorate my own cake. He's going to decorate. <laughs> What'd you pick up today? I uh, picked up the set there of the bakeware. Oh. I also uh, have his pots and pans from last uh, time you were on. I absolutely love them. Nothing <laughs> sticks to mm. them, just like he says. Right. Isn't it and so incredible? And I have a toaster oven. Yeah. I have a lot of good things from Chef. Vicky, tell me about the cookware. Do you find that nothing sticks to it and you can just wipe it clean really simply? Absolutely. Yeah. Just like you said, you no, wipe it clean. Um, I've used it now for at least two months or so or a month yep. and a half and nothing sticks. Well, I'm Vicky, amazed. I've still got the first prototypes of the very first thing that we ever did, <laughs> and that's about 10 years ago or eight wow. years ago. So um, I still use them. They're still on my kitchen counter, so yours are going to be around for a long time to come, my darling. So I thank you so, so much for giving us a call. Because I've had a lot of them in my ears. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> thank you. Be it. Thank you, Vicky. You Thanks, have a wonderful Vicky. holiday season. You're an Take angel. good care. Thank Thanks, you. Darling. You too. Bye-bye. Thanks so much.
Okay. All, right. yeah, all three so. of these, sorry again, that you're receiving here. I know he's got another show this evening and that's it. Over 33,000 now, 34,000 wow. have been ordered. Oh, goodness. So again, it's under it's getting limited. $6. You just choose your color. This right here, this is the one that we're showing goes into your toaster oven. It's not just nonstick on the front, it's nonstick on the back. This is nine by 13. Again, all the way around those four layers. You're also going to receive the 10 by 15, which is right here. So again, that's perfect for doing all of your cookies. We did the casseroles in this. And then the Mac Daddy, this is the 10 by 15, or 12 by 17, excuse me, 12 by 17 <laughs> size. This is that huge lasagna pan, Right, basically. that's like a foot and a half by a foot, basically. Wow. You know, so that's the big one. But sometimes you want the small one. You know, sometimes you want to re-eat a slice of pizza or something exactly. simple. Exactly, and again, this this is not right. bakeware that you've got a baby. So strong. Oh, look at this. I mean, check this out. So, oh. talking about, this is the small the of the three. Okay, now oh. it's a standing rib roast. Have a look at the pan mm. here because what I've done is I've roasted all these mm. vegetables mm. and again you're seeing me here. In fact mm. Rochelle I'm going to get a little plate yes. uh, or a bigger plate than that one please my darling because I want to pour these vegetables off. Thank you sweetheart. You can just sit it there on the board. Um, so watch this. I'm going to go ahead and take those vegetables off. Mm. You see all of the, res the um, residue that's been sort of baking away um, there and now watch mm. this while I uh, wipe it out. I'm going to get a cloth. I'm going to give that a real quick wipe and have a look at that. That was in the oven for about an hour and 20 minutes and the pan mm. is now officially spotless. Okay, so we know it's easy on the cleanup, but let me tell you why it's important for the roasting. When you're cooking a standing rib like this, what you want, and look at this mm -hmm. beautiful piece of meat, Oh, that's you want that heat to be able to circulate mm. all the way around, and that's what this enables you to do. By the way, go on to hsn.com. This is a standing rib roast. Can you imagine serving this on Christmas dinner? Oh, yes. Because now you can. This is the Angus Pure. This is the Australian beef that I've been bringing to you all. This is so delicious and so wonderful. It's roast mm. beef on the bone. Have a look at it. Super juicy. Let me just get my Santuku oh, knife in there. That. Have a look at this, you guys. Oh. So you'll be able to slice this up for the holiday feast that you're going to have for you and your family. Oh, look Beautiful, at that. Beautiful, medium rare. One more little tool that I want to show you. I've got myself... Oh, this is brilliant. This is a thermometer, okay? But not any thermometer. I'm going to shake it and watch what happens. See how it lights up and it comes on? So that's basically um, a kinetic th thermometer, right? So let me go ahead and put it in there. This is going to give me a digital readout of the temperature. Can you see that okay? I'll sort of try and angle it a little bit to you. There you go, so 135 is what it's at right now. So that's telling me that this is gonna be a perfect medium rare. So when I go ahead and carve it, and by the way, all of the, all of the measurements that you need are on the back there, this will never run out of batteries. Whenever you need it, you give it a shake and it's ready to go again. That is so cool. It's really exceptional. So whether you're doing a prime rib, by the way, hsn.com, go check it out. You can buy a six pound piece of prime rib for something like 149 no bucks. It's a crazy, crazy Maybe deal. Best. I have to try a piece of this end piece. And Look at that. Isn't you that did so this good? on top. That pan was nothing. Normally, if you cooked a roast, right. and if you do one every Sunday like I try to do, my gosh, you have to soak that pan, right? What do you yep. have to do for cleanup? This is it. You get all three of them today for $6. Right. Six dollars. So think about the Thanksgiving baking and the stuffing and all oh, the turkey. The turkey. Well, here oh, we go. Let me show you this. First of all, in the shallow hey. pan, right, in, in the sheet pan, the heat can go all the way around. Mm. So you're getting beautiful golden brown turkey mm. all the way down, all the way around it, which I think is really important. Next job, you take your kinetic thermometer, you engage it by giving it a little shake. Can you see that, how it just turns itself on? That's mm. now going to give you power for about two minutes, which is as much as you need it. You you go ahead, you plug it into the turkey, it's going to give you a digital readout, mm. 150, 150, mm. 149, 148, it might keep dropping for just another second, let's watch it. So this is going to tell us the internal temperature of the turkey. How high do we need poultry to be? We need poultry to be 165, we're down at 143. So I can tell you, even though this looks perfectly cooked, the, the thigh here is still a little under, right? So you're not going to, you're not going to serve it, you're going to put it back in the oven and carry on cooking it um, for a little bit longer. So this guy is really so valuable, especially around the holidays. My gosh, because we usually bring it out once a year just for the holiday season. And then what happens? The battery's broken. Right. There is no battery in it. And a so, lot of times the batteries are more than the entire thermometer. You're and so don't right. press those pop-ups. 
because I don't know if it's really no, you, in the, you, you know? should you should really have your own thermometer by the way the reason I invented this is when I go out to the grill I just want a little thing that I can put in my pocket so I now can just shake that with me I can oh. keep it in my pocket like that while I'm out grilling and I always know when the steaks are perfectly cooked so it's a great gift that is brilliant all right so that turkey needs another minute so I'm going to put that back in the oven in the meantime I've got these what incredible tarts have a look at this oh my god another one of Rochelle's recipes in the book in the bakeware cookbook these are pear and cranberry brilliant for the holidays um, and again have a look even though that jam is starting to sort of spill out of the uh, the bakeware um, out of the pies onto the bakeware all you're going to do is give it a real quick wipe and boom mm. you do a bake's ready to go again can i have one of these please here let me take one down oh here and as we do this we're going to say hello to pam from indiana oh hi pam pam how comfort? are you you're live on the air. It's Amy and Jeff Carter yes. Stone. Hi. Hi. Happy birthday. Thank you, Pam. Oh, <laughs> this is so nice. Welcome. I've never had... I wanted to... What I wanted to call, I, if I ever got the chance to talk to you, I have your pan, your baked pans, your muffin pans, your cake pans, but I baked mm. a pumpkin pie for my son-in-law. Oh, and I had put it on one of those baked pans, and I had hit my hand putting it into the oven, and oh, it no. sloshed. I went ahead and baked it anyway, <laughs> and, of course, where it had sloshed over, it had burnt completely back black. I thought I was going to have to throw the pans away. My neighbor had come over. I got it out, and it just lifted right up out off Yay! the pan. Isn't it was that incredible? amazing. You know, I say this all the time, Pam, it's kind of, mm. it, it's a bit of an insurance policy because, you know, sometimes things go wrong in the kitchen and even when it does, it doesn't really matter if it's in my pans, the, the Dura Bake or the Dura Pan, because it will just still slide out. And that's proof right there, my darling, even when something went wrong. Was your hand okay? Oh, yeah. Yeah, my hand was okay, but like I said, I went ahead and, and baked a pie for my son-in-law for his birthday, but Sweet. I did. I, I had never seen anything like it in my life. It just lifted right out of it. Oh, That's I'm the so beauty. Glad. And That's you get all beauty. three of them today. It's such a good deal. Isn't this a good deal, Pam? Yes, it is. It's a wonderful deal. I have sure four is. of the big ones, oh. two of the muffin pans, two of the cake pans. Is the cleanup as easy as we say, darling, even, even just in your day-to-day -day use? Yes. Yes, it is awesome. Yay, I'm so Pam. glad. Well, you have a wonderful holiday season, and we appreciate you shopping with us. Thank you, Pam. Take good you care, too. Pam. Bye-bye. And don't forget, bye -bye. all three. So uh, you're not choosing here. You get all three. A baker, right. that's a huge deal. A lot of people are asking us online, where do I Which one do I get? Want? Yeah, which one should I choose? No, you now, get all three. Here's, here's another thing that I want you to see, you guys. This is the Turner. It's just one of a set of three. It comes with a spurtle and an incredible spoon. Really flexible. Here's why. Because when I want to cut like a, a, a piece out of a crumble, let's say, I can go through, mm. and now it's going to be difficult to get out unless I have something nice and flexible that I can actually use to get underneath. You can see how sticky yes. this is, by the way. You know, so you can now get under it. Now, I'm going to show you this really simply because... Only a 1,000 left of those you utensils ladies and you just choose whether and you get all three of them i highly recommend them i have them in the red there's only a thousand of those that's it in stone gray that's oh, it wow. look that's at this it. look at this oh. sticky crumble look how it just falls out of the pan God, and don't worry some loving. we'll look eat that, that afterwards with a little ice cream oh yeah have a piece now it's oh. so good have a taste you know, I, don't, of that. I couldn't possibly eat another thing <laughs> 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 oh look at this this is the beauty of cooking. I absolutely love, I'm such a foodie. I love cooking. I love watching cooking. I love cooking for other people. But when you don't have the right type of cooking utensils or cooking pieces or vessels, I used to hate to cook. Right. This makes it so much easier for you to cook. It makes the cleanup a breeze. And even if you spill something on it or you really burn something to the you know what, like I've done before, everything just slides right out. Right. This is the last type of bakeware you're ever gonna have to buy. Mm -hmm. You get all three pieces. We'll show you the colors again because we have five gorgeous colors, but we got to show you. Oh, look at this shrimp. I mean, this is another sheet pan dinner. It's just peppers, some onions, some shrimp, all chopped up, thrown onto a sheet oh pan, a little drizzle of oh. uh, vinegar and oil, and you throw it in maybe mm. uh, 375 for 20 minutes, 15 minutes probably even. Oh, and look at that. Those. The whole dinner is done. If you Google <laughs> sheet pan dinners or go onto <laughs> Pinterest or Instagram or one of those and just have a look around, mm, you'll it. get all these incredible ideas. And what they're talking about is throwing your dinner onto a sheet pan, baking it in the oven, and it's that simple.
really, really eat. So I'm just going to stop and let no, you go no. with a mouthful of nachos. <laughs> I can't stop with the nachos. I know. I don't blame you. They're so good. They're so good. Gosh. It's really true. And to get the cheese melted Ooh, all pizza. the way, the way you've done that is brilliant. Okay. Okay, now you mentioned my little pizza oven, so here it is, and you're seeing this come right out of there. So whether it's a homemade pizza like this one that we've done, or if you're reheating a pizza slice from your oh, favorite look restaurant. look how beautiful that is. Right, isn't that oh, you're so cool? Burn your finger. Okay, Don't no, worry, no, look, no. it just okay. literally slides oh. out of the pan. There's the pan. And look then that. the Santuku knife. You guys, please tell me how many we have left, because I know that we started with the day with only, only a couple of thousand. We only have three more minutes in this presentation, ladies. It's under $6. Don't forget, the best thing about shopping with us here at H and send us exclusive brands from people like Chef Curtis Stone, who's designing just for us. Nobody has his nonstick bakeware. It's only here at HSN. It's less than a $6 bill, and we take every major credit card. So try it. If you don't love it, you can send it back. There's a 1,000 mm. left of that Santuco knife. Oh, wow, Just that's choose it. your color of our today's special, and that's it. That's all you have to do to match your beautiful kitchen. We've got five gorgeous colors. There, we're showing it to you in that, what we're calling turquoise blue. Which we is also... on fire. I think it's my favorite, that turquoise blue. I don't and know I about you, but uh, everybody is getting that turquoise blue. And then we also have it for you in the traditional stone. We also have it for you in gold, which is beautiful. And then we have it in the red and the green. So those are your color options. Again, you cannot destroy these. I've had them since Curtis launched them. They're beautiful. So, ooh, look at, look at that. that. That's parmesan cheese, right? So the reason I'm showing that demonstration is because I'm using the back of the pan. So we put the nonstick not only on the inside of the pan, but also on the back of the pan for when you want to do, you. you know, something like this parmesan crisp. Yeah, and yes. then, of course, you can wipe it up. And hey, presto, there's the pan. You know, so See? you get the nonstick 300. And, yeah, it's a bit more expensive for us to do in production, but I would rather give you total flexibility. And I also think it looks nicer it when does. it's the whole thing's the same. All right, we're going to head out to our phones. Mary's calling us from California. Happy holidays, Mary. You're live on the air. It's Amy, Chef, Curtis Stone, Rochelle. Everybody's here. Ready? Kat, how you doing? Oh, thank you. This is Mary from Lake Elsinore, California. <laughs> Curtis, happy birthday from Lisa and Mary. Oh, we thank you, Mary. Best. How are you, sweetheart? We order everything that you have. My, I just ordered the cookie sheets. I already bought it for my daughter. She <laughs> just got the knife. She's getting it for Christmas. She's got your pots and bags. Let me tell you, you are the best. Oh, Yay, you're the Mary. best. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're okay. awesome, darling. He is the oh, best, thank Mary. Thank you so much. There's nothing like his cookware or his pans, is there, oh, Mary? Oh, no. He is the best. The best. <laughs> we look forward to you coming on TV. My daughter texted me last night, Curtis Stone on Saturday. Yay! <laughs> I'm so good. Mary, are you cooking Thanksgiving? Uh, yeah, probably am. But I use a lot of his pots and pans, everything. My daughter has everything of his. Aww. Mary, how many do you normally cook for on Thanksgiving? How many do we normally cook for? Maybe eight. Yeah. Oh, that's good. So, but here's the thing. For Thanksgiving, it's always more than normal, right? I don't know how many is normally in your home. Like, probably, how, how many do you normally have? Uh, probably about that much because right. everybody's out of state. Right. Well, we're a family of four. We've got two boys and me and my wife, Linz. But for Thanksgiving, it's normally like 10 or 12 that, that I'm Absolutely. cooking for. And that's when you need yeah. those extra pieces, whether it's more sheet exactly. pans or more cookware. And uh, exactly. this is the time of year to bulk up on it. But, Mary, thank you so much for your call, my darling. Oh, we really Curtis, appreciate it. Again, happy birthday. We thank love you. everything that you make. Keep it up. Oh, She's amazing. What a sweetheart. Thank you thank so much, you, Mary. Darling. You have a wonderful holiday. Bye-bye. Thank you so much. All right, we only have about a minute left. Okay. Look at this. I'm going to show you the, the turkey. French fries. The turkey's back out of the oven. So let's have a look and see what's happened. Again, your mm. kinetic... Oh, isn't that so good? So we call those the Irish um, nachos because they're made with potatoes. Irish nachos. Instead of corn chips. Oh! <laughs> Here's, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to probe this turkey again. This time oh I'm God, probing no. the breast and we're looking for 160 mm. degrees. Look at that. Mm. We're at 161. So we're good. We're safe. We know that the turkey's now done, right? right? If I go down here into the leg, what are we at down there? Yep, that's looking good. I'll push it further down into the thigh. 106, 100. Oh we're over God. 160. Our turkey's ready to go. Imagine having that peace of mind, knowing that with your kinetic thermometer, and again, let me show it to you. Uh, this one's off, okay? Mm. So there's no batteries in these. You will never, ever have to buy a battery. Watch this. It's off. I shake it like that, 
and look, up she comes. It look turns that. itself on. Um, I'll hold it upside down. It turns itself on, and this will now stay on for the next couple of minutes. If it turns itself off, you give it another shake, and away you go. Really brilliant that piece. That is the coolest invention ever. Right. One more thing I'm going to show you before we go, because I know we're moving on. This is my chef's cutting board, right? Mm. It's this big old thing. It's beautiful for uh, the holidays. So beautiful. I've got measurements and everything on this side of the board. You flip it over to be the perfect carving board. It's made out of bamboo, which of course is a sustainable material. Look you lift up that. your turkey, grab your Santuku knife. We're down to the last thousand, which means we've already sold a thousand of these this morning. So make sure you get one while we've still got them in stock. What is the proper way to carve a turkey? I'm so glad we're doing this right now. Okay, so this is how I like to do okay. it. I carve straight off the breast like this, okay. right? Now, if you wanted to, you could go straight down this breast plate, Amy, yeah. right? And you could go straight down. You could open that up, okay? And then you can remove the whole breast. So you pull that back. You see I'm using yeah, my yeah, bear yeah. claw in there as well. And then you're actually able to remove that whole piece of meat. So oh. then it makes your whole life a whole lot simpler, right? Because the whole thing's going to fall out. Look at that juicy um, that little surprise in there? there. Well, that's stuff. <laughs> that's uh, the stuffing. Isn't oh. that nice? So oh, then... The <laughs> Mm -hmm. Then you just flip that over and Ooh. see now you're able to go ahead and slice that turkey breast Look how off the bone. Juicy that is! Because we cooked it right. Because we had the thermometer, we cooked it to the right temperature, and that's what's going to happen see, every single the time. Why is your turkey dry? Because Amy Morrison, because you overcook it every year. Have a taste of that. Right? You know it is so is moist like... and juicy. It's a little warm. I don't want to burn you for the third time. Mmm. <laughs> That's turkey. Oh my gosh. I'm just going to wrap this up. Mm. Take it home so Thanksgiving I'll just serve this. We got this. you. We got you. Oh. Isn't it so good? Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, yeah. Delicious. Mm. And that crispy skin. Okay, excuse us. No, we're just going to eat turkey. Mm. Really? So it's about having the right temperature. It's about well, having... What are you cooking it at? This guy. The okay, kinetic thermometer. You only have it at, what, 300 degrees? Okay. 375 down to 300. So okay. depending on how big your turkey is, you might want to put a piece of foil over That's it. That's what I do, and put a start. lot of butter on it. That's right, then you remove the foil, let it crisp up nice and beautiful, um, and then, and then of course, you need to cook it to the right temperature, about 160. That's, that's the key. You've got to have the right tools. If you want it, you've got to be picking it up now. Mm -hmm. Don't forget, we have, what, 38,000 of our today's special sold. If you want and that, you get all three pieces of these. That's it, you get the toaster oven size, you also get the large 12 by 17, and you get the 10 by 15 size. You get all three, it's under $6. If you don't love it, even after Thanksgiving dinner, you send it back, no questions asked, you're gonna fall in love with it. Um, but we've got more surprises for you. We sure do. Oh, we do wanna let you know what's available on hsn.com. I don't think I've mentioned this enough yet. I will tell you, everything is on five interest-free credit card payments, including his food. Yes. Okay, we're gonna be talking about something that is very near and dear to Chef's heart. There's only 100 available of his launch of his Angus Pure Beef. Now, mm -hmm. when he first originally did this at HSN, I think it was his last visit, it all completely sold out. Mm -hmm. Completely sold out. Now you can secure it on auto ship, you can also get it single ship, but today you're saving, what is that, from 164 to 149, so $15 today. Try it for under $30. If you don't love it, no questions asked. And it's not like you can send it back because you've already had it. This is an unbelievable piece of beef. It's a six pound standing rib roast, right? So when you're thinking about the holidays and you want that real showpiece, it's the one that I just carved for you. I always cook this same piece of beef in my rotisserie in the little oven that you've seen, if you've ever seen me carve that. So juicy, so beefy and delicious in flavor and so easy to cook. So. They, there is only a hundred of them, and I think some have already sold. So oh, I know. if you want it, get in while you can. You can. And don't forget, you know Chef Curtis Stone is our number one best-selling brand here at HSN? Think about that. That's huge. So we do want to let you know everything's been on fire. Everything from Chef is five inches free credit card payments. The muffin pan just sold out. I'm sorry. Oh, already? And I'm just starting. Just sold out. Just sold oh. out. Okay. All right, so here's what muffins we have. are gone. Oh, geez, muffins are gone. Guys, we told you. No, wait a minute, you... we gotta show. But look at yeah. this little love and goodness. Aren't they going so beautiful? These what little biscuits. These are gorgeous <gasps> little country biscuits with Gruyere it. cheese over the top. Is this Gruyere? Oh, no. oh my gosh, look you, at the popovers. By the way, Stop. you can also do it in the popovers, and I think we still have some popovers left. Do we? We do. Please tell me we do. Okay, we do. good. Okay, very so, limited. We sold out the muffins. So these are the popovers. Um, 
there's a set of oh. six. I'm doing these popovers right here. We call them Yorkshire puddings where I'm from. They're so good. Look at that. Oh, Look how yeah. evenly brown they are. Popovers are very difficult to get that beautiful brown. There's always some kind mm. of burn spot on them. Oh, so oh, the yeah. popovers are only $18.50, and you choose, you want the gold or the red, and then we have the two round pans, a.k.a. cake pans. You get two of them for $21.50. Ooh, this, uh, you could even do casseroles inside of this, too, Absolutely. if you wanted to. Absolutely, yep, you sure There's can. only 200 left of those. Wow, chef. Okay, what do we show next? Everything's selling. <laughs> Everything's moving. Every, you know what? We sold out of the trivet. We sold out of... Um, the knives uh, are next the, to go. The knives will be next to go. We already sold out of the little bench scraper that we had earlier. So when we say things are about to go, guys, we really do mean it. Um, mm. And all of this bakeware is mm. about to be out the door. So I've got a little side-by-side -side comparison here for you. We're starting off with our oh. cake pan, right? So this is the round cake pan. Oh. You can do it one of two ways. You can do it in the dura bake, in the dura bake, right? And then this is what happens when you turn it over. It flips out. It behaves oh, look at itself. That beautiful brown. Gorgeous caramelization, right? So that's the dura pan. That's the dura bake. Let's do it. Is this hot? No, that's. Um, this is a, a, a traditional pan. And this is what happens, okay? It gets stuck. No so matter then how much you've sprayed in it. You then go around it like this, and you try and dig it out. And you try again. And, oh, no! Okay, isn't that the worst? And then, then you try and put it all back together, okay? And look, here's the other problem. Oh. You're with this miserable pan, and look at it. It's so flimsy, and I can literally... Look, I can just break look at it. that. You know, oh. and, and when I show you the difference between... Oh, that's still hot. <laughs> when I show you the difference between that and my DuraBake, listen to this. Do you hear how I solid know. that? That's carbon steel. There's no way, in no any way, I'm, I'm able to, to bend that. So it just goes to show wow. the difference that we're talking about. You this know, is, this is from making it or breaking. Look at the difference in that. Right. That happens to every. We've all been there. Oh, for sure. This is Rochelle's sticky buns. Also, recipe um, available in her uh, in her bakeware cookbook. And oh check my it out. God. I oh. mean, yeah. I know what I want to be serving the morning after Thanksgiving. Oh, Rochelle. Your sticky buns, Rochelle. <laughs> Look at that. Stop it. It's good. Oh, okay. And here's the cleanup. We just sold out of the two rounds. We oh, did? the two rounds are gone. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay. So now just the popovers. Popovers That's all are left. left. Okay. So here's, here's what's so cool about the popovers. So many different things you can do in it. Of course, popovers. What have we got here, Rochelle? What did you make? So those are the bakas. Chocolate oh, bakas. Oh, my goodness. For Christmas, how so wonderful bakas. those are. How good is that? Mm -hmm. so, comes right out with years. all that chocolatey goodness all around the sides. So, Still and comes out. Look, I always say this. You can make them. You can get as crazy as you like. Or, of course, you can go ahead and you can buy the Pillsbury and you can go ahead and just... Nothing wrong know, with the good old Pillsbury. Semi make it, you know, oh, it's totally up to you. The best part of all, of course, is that these just wipe on out. So, w w no matter oh. what we're showing you today, all of the Dura Bake uh, is yes. the same. Amy, I love okay. that you just get so taken. Jello, frozen Isn't that so bacon. fabulous? <laughs> 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 so, so good. Here are some other things you can do. These are, these are champagne okay, raspberry jello. Out. Oh, that's gone too. Okay. Oh, but you Thank know you what? very much. Thank you, Rochelle. I'm so glad she's here. Oh, yeah. There you go. So this is the what pizza is pan set? set. So this is the deep round, right? You can see how big and deep that is. Okay. And then this has got the perforated tray, perfect for making pizzas. And then, of course, this <gasps> is like a, a deep dish um, pan, which, of course, no. you would be using as a roaster too. Didn't you used to sell just a regular? We did. I have that yeah. one. So now I just put this down in it to kind of... You can. Oh, you can do it solo. You can do them together. This could be a deep dish. Truly, this is a great roasting dish as well, you know, oh, making potatoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so there's so many different uses for it. Casseroles, you could do all of that in there. 14 inches, you guys. Yeah, casseroles, braises, slow cooks, you name it. There's so many different things that you can use this for. I love it. If you want it, you get all three pieces today for $19.95. Don't forget, it's five interest free credit card payments as well. It's only $3.99. So if you missed out on the cake pan, mm -hmm. you can pick this. And these are the big Mamma Jamma ones. Look at the size of this. So these are huge, and you get all three. Right. It's wow. huge. Now, I'm going to just brag on my girl, Rochelle, for one more time. This is called The Bakeware Cookbook, all right? This is her companion book that she wrote. I love her recipes. Clearly, I love her recipes. Um, you know, she just comes up with the most incredible sweet things and then the best Ooh. savory dishes as well. I mean, look at this tart here, full of tomatoes. And then today you were making it with beets. There's so many. And you put a lot of those tips and tricks into your book, Rochelle. I do. I do. 
valuable those little tips are. And so I thought, you know, any tip that I found valuable, I put it in the book so that you guys have it at home too. Yeah. So, it's yeah. It's such a beautiful piece, Rochelle. Yeah. You Thank should be you. really Amazing. proud of it. Amazing. I'm telling you, there's oh, the sticky buns. You get the recipes for the sticky buns. It's only $15.95. Yeah, I'm telling you, the recipes are simple. The recipes are easy. The flavor is absolutely amazing. Don't forget about our today's special. We still have that available for you. We have thousands of you still trying to order it. I don't want you to miss out on your color. So if you want that, we've got them for Where you instead of like three. Carving. Oh, but now, oh. Sandwiches. Oh yeah. Oh, Jeff, we're, oh, this way. I need you, Amy. I'm coming. I need I'm, you. I need you too, okay. <laughs> Look at this. Now, this is huge oh, sure. for everybody. We Adam. have for you this amazing black Angus. Look at the way that this is coming to you. Black Angus, mm -hmm. six pound bone in. Now this is his prime rib. It's better than butter, baby. But tell everybody why you fell in love with where this cattle's from. Okay, so first of all, um, and we can jump to the farm, um, the shot of the farm while I test the temperature here. But that's Darren Thomas, who you're about to see. He's a buddy of mine, he owns Thomas Family Farms, the biggest, um, uh, most beautiful farm you've ever been to. Oh, His steers, the, the cattle that he has are all grass fed. Angus Pure is the breed, they roam free. It's a healthier choice. When you're buying grass fed beef, of course it's a healthy choice. You know, it's it's, uh, can you say, can you feed gra grain fed to your family? You can. I personally would rather do what the animal's supposed to do. They're supposed to roam free. They're supposed to eat grass. That's, that's right. how they were designed. And that's what we love doing with them. So it tastes fantastic. It's so juicy and delicious. I'm putting my kin kinetic th thermometer in here. I know it is at 135 in the core um, right there. So I know that this is beautifully cooked. Let's get carving. I've got my Santoku oh. knife. Now, what's the proper way to carve? carve a prime rib. Okay, so let me show you. There's two ways to do it. You can either carve it straight off like I did prior, or what you can do is you can go down the back oh, here. Oh, right, at that. And you can just remove those bones. Now, I love those bones, so I go then turn that over, and I go through those beautiful big rib bones because I love to, uh, I love to not only serve them, I love to eat them. So we stack that up there. Then you turn your, your standing rib over here, and you're going to go ahead and slice it. Now, oh, you can that. slice it thin, you can slice it thick. Look Again, at look at how juicy and fantastic this is. I mean, easy it is I'm just going to squeeze oh. down on that. Look at that. It's just so beautiful. Oh, my gosh. This is a lot of meat. Think about this. This would easily six pounds, serve, yeah. Yeah, easily serve six people, nine oh, people more. dinner. Yeah, yeah, ten. You'd get ten, ten oh. to twelve. Absolutely. Like for this price, remember, it's the quality of the beef that you're buying. This, again, is that black Angus beef look well, that. flown in from Australia. Look how juicy that is. Okay. Now, here's the thing about people say, well, why Australia? Let me explain it to you. First of all, we got lots of space over there. <laughs> we're a huge <laughs> country. I think we're nearly as big as America, but we only have 24 million people. So we've got plenty of space for the cows. So there's lots of delicious grass for them to eat. Mm. Um, it's a very clean, very pure place to be. Um, it's an island, so it's free from disease or anything like that. Uh, and it just has the most beautiful beef. Have a look at this. And this, of course, is wet-aged for nearly four weeks. Look at all that beautiful juice that came out. And here, I wouldn't waste any of that. No, we would, would never do that. I would pile those bones up. <gasps> I would pick up my board and I would bring that straight over the top, oh. drizzle that over. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that, ladies and gents. Look at that. Oops. Oh, a little soft. <laughs> Got a little excited there. Look at that. You know what? This beef, if you're thinking about serving this, maybe even for Thanksgiving instead of turkey, or think about this for Christmas, we right. usually do a roast at Christmas time too. Mm -hmm. How beautiful would that be? It's only $29.99, so you can break this up over monthly interest-free payments because so many of us would love to serve right. beef like that. Well, this is how it's coming to you. Yes. It's a beautiful big standing rib of beef. Ooh. You can see it right there on the bone. It's just absolutely gorgeous. It comes to you. Gosh, look at that. Frozen solid, okay? And here's the great part. Okay. Look at that. It comes to you like this. It will be frozen solid. You'll drop it in the freezer. It lasts up to six months just like that. I'm going to carve you another one, Amy, because I know oh just how incredible this is. That flavor. Isn't that unbelievable? Mm. Okay, so let's have another look at this. Mm. Again, I'm just going to go on through here. Have oh, a look at look this at beef. I mean, let me carve through it, and then let me just mm. give you a little push on that. See the juice in that roast beef? Can you believe it? Imagine how juicy and fantastic the flavour of this is going to be. Mm. What do you think, Amy? What's it taste like? 
Are you talking to me? I'm yeah. Sorry. <laughs> She's just off, off in the clouds. Oh my gosh. Mm. That flavor is so good. Look at this. And it, you know what? It, it's almost like as tender as a filet mignon. Mm -hmm. Why is that? I mean, it, it, it just well, melts in your mouth. The ribeye, the standing rib, is one of the most tender muscles in the, in the, um, mm. in the whole cattle, and it's so juicy. I just love the tenderness of it. I do too. It's, it is, mm. and the flavor. You don't need to add any extra salt. No mm -hmm. Worcestershire sauce. No, nothing else to spice it up. Why do we add a lot of spices to our steaks? Well, maybe we enjoy it, but I think the most important mm. thing is we add it because the flavor's not there. Don't forget, it's on five interest-free credit card payments, free shipping. Oh on six pounds of bone-in prime rib, the best of the best. Don't forget, we also have this on auto ship if you would like. You can secure it every 90 days, 120 days, whenever you want it. But to get this quality home at this price for under $30 oh. is unheard of. And I'll mm. tell you right now, you will not be disappointed in anything that Chef Curtis Stone brings to us. Don't forget, everything he brings to us is a customer pick. If you don't see it being a customer pick, probably because it's brand spanking new. He is our number one best-selling brand this here is, at HSN. Today special. And this is it. He's getting you ready for the holiday hey, season. And go to the Today Special. Oh, there's that meat. And how many of us are having everybody oh. over the holiday season? And we're baking our cookies for Christmas time. And we're baking all the desserts. And we're baking the frittatas. This is the time of year when we love entertaining and everybody comes over, well, how would you love to not only entertain in style, but have that maintenance-free cookware or bakeware that you've always wanted? That's exactly what Chef Curtis Stone does for us exclusively here at HSN. Nobody else has what we're ready to offer you next. This is the eight-piece set. You just choose whether you want this 